Hi, Leo Dreger here. In this module, I want to talk about buffer overflows. Now, we're going to need to start thinking like machine language, a computer, because this is how does a computer store things in its memory and how can we manipulate that process? Now, it's basically pretty simple. I want you to imagine an ice cube tray, right? This is a modular framework. So if you put too much water into one cube, it overflows into another. Well, memory sort of behaves the same thing, but every ice cube is its own application or its own space. So that's the basics. Now we're going to cover some of the different tools and techniques that you can use um, and also cover the different types of threats and the different types of software in which we can use. But this is a specialized field of study because you realistically uh, now really, you really have to think like a programmer in this, in this sense. So let's go ahead and get started. Let's talk about buffer overflows.